Hi, my friends. Welcome. So, are you ready to arrive? Are you ready to arrive right now in the new paradigm? Um, I brought the joy tuning of the harp today to help us do that. Um, there's been a lot of requests for this tuning recently. Um, this tuning just it's the warm flowing river of therapy harps. And before we get started with today's uh, sound healing, I'd like to remind everyone that I have therapy harps in stock for the 20, for the August 27 to 29 therapy harp practitioner certification at the Sacred Sound of the Soul in Encinitas, California, also streaming live all over the world. So if you are the world's next therapy harp healer, please reach out to me. We love working with people to make this accessible to everyone because the world needs more healers right now. <laughs> so that said, back to that paradigm shift. You know, those words, paradigm shift, is something that has been on the lips of the, of, you know, the New Age community for uh, quite a while now, you know, um, probably being very prevalent for more than a decade. But here we are. We have arrived. If you need any evidence, just look around at the state of the world and how things have changed. Think back to a year and a half ago when we were all saying, I can't wait till things get back to normal. And now here we are realizing that that normal doesn't exist anymore. And we've moved into something new. Things are changing. And the only way forward is by releasing our white knuckled grip on the past. And sometimes that's a hard thing to do because our our um, attachment to the way things were, the way things always have been, the way things should be, <laughs> so we think, feels like us. It feels like you. It feels like the very fabric from which you are made. And you have not yet known the you that will exist in a new paradigm none of us have. So it doesn't always feel safe to let go of the past, to let go of old ways, old paradigms, old ways of being, even if they're not serving us, even if they never really did. Isn't that so often the case? That's why we keep reliving the same pesky things that we wish we could outgrow. And so I thought that today it would be nice to share with you a way to create the safe space in which you can finally begin to release the old ways of you that are no longer serving the high self. And you know, um, if you need a little more explanation of what it means to arrive in the right now, in the new paradigm, that is exactly what it is. It's arriving into the expression of your true authentic self. What does that mean? That means following your passions. That means being exactly who you truly are not hiding, not camouflaging, you know, not, um, not um, fitting someone else's expectations or someone else's paradigm. It's really about each and every one of us waking up into our own because when we do that, then we become a whole. Then there's peace. If that doesn't, it's the, um, it's, it's when we try to conform to other people's shapes that they want us to be in that we have discordance with each other. You never can fit into the shape that someone else wants you to be. You can only fit into the shape that you were born to be. And once we all do that, then there will be peace and bar harmony and balance between all of us, 
between us and nature, between us and earth, us and the universe. And that is what I mean by arriving. So let's arrive already. <laughs> No more talking, let's do it. So I always recommend wearing earbuds or headphones for these sessions. Make yourself nice and comfortable. This is a sound healing, different than a sound bath, so I'm inviting you to be an active participant, a co-creator in this work. So as you settle in, pardon me, this might make a little bit of noise. There we go, that's better. Yes, so as you settle in, Surrender your physical body to gravity. When we dr begin to drop down into that beautiful theta state of being, maybe later going deeper or technically higher into the state of gamma, we begin by Surrendering the physical, surrendering time and surrendering attachment to our environment. Allowing the eyes to close. As you just fall back as if onto a cloud and allow yourself to be caught held and cradled in the arms of gravity. Take an internal stretch with a deep, full breath. Stretching the space around your heart as if creating space within to receive today's work. Take one more big deep breath and then continue with successive breaths that get softer, more shallow, more gentle. As if an ocean within you is becoming calm. between the thoughts becomes farther apart, like distant clouds drifting off onto the horizon. The mind becomes silent.
Let's move on now into creating a safe space in which we feel secure to release the past, release attachment to what was so and make space for what will be. Maybe even make space for our true selves to shine to the surface of our being. inviting you now to envision, to create, to encircle yourself in a protective golden light. And you can call upon source, energy, whatever the source of that source may be to you. To implement that circle of protective golden light like an eggshell that surrounds you. circle of protective golden light through which only that which is in alignment with your highest self and your highest good may enter. circle of golden light within which only that which is in alignment with your highest self and good may exist. It's okay to allow yourself to be in a space where all that exists is as and of your highest self. Give yourself permission to breathe this into existence now.
inviting you now to invite that golden protective light, the light of source, the light with which only that which is in alignment with your highest self may exist to surround your heart. So that within your heart, your center of center, within the history of your heart, the present moment and the future, only that which is in alignment with your highest self may exist. And so it is.
take this moment to observe your inner terrain, the peacefulness, the centeredness, the stillness. Here in the center of center, the heart of your heart. surrendered in the protection of source light, able to be the full expression of you. Begin now the process of breathing that centeredness, that arrival into the wholeness of you, to the surface of your being, to the you that interacts. a deeper breath now, once again expanding the space around the heart, this time with the intention of creating physical space, energetic space, emotional space within, to hold, to nurture, to contain, to host more expansive aspects of you, the high self. Deeper your breath goes, allow that breath to make its way to your fingertips and your toes. Finding your way into a stretch and a yawn. to bring yourself back physically, yet bring yourself forward. Internally, arriving to right now. Whole, centered. The expression of your high self, your light, your love, your joy at the surface of your being on the <laughs> lips, the tongue of every word. Evolving, even as they soften and center. And here we are, beginning to step our way into the new paradigm, the new way of being.
offer you this work of creating a golden light of protection around your entire being, every aspect and dimension of you, internally and externally, every day, so that you feel safe to release, to surrender that which no longer serves you, and to walk boldly forward into a new paradigm of wholeness, of balanced oneness with all. <laughs> Happy arrivals. Thank you so much, everyone, for joining me. As always, the work that you do serves my purpose of raising frequency on Earth, raising awareness on Earth. Um, when you do this work, you not only help yourself, but you raise your own frequency, and therefore, believe it or not, you're raising the frequency of your neighbors. Your entire neighborhood just got charged. <laughs> How about that? And so it ripples out, the butterfly effect. And uh, That's not my intention, that's fact. So thank you for the work that you do in this world. Please be in touch, reach out to me. I'm available for private one-on-one -on -one sessions. I'm so excited to be getting back to work now, working one-on-one -on -one with people at the beautiful Sacred Sound of the Soul Gallery in Encinitas, California. These sessions are also, of course, available online. I love connecting with you. Many blessings. Have a beautiful, beautiful week ahead.